just a day of adding this to your bed water, your success will shock the world. This work instantly. Add it to your bed water to end lack, hatred, poverty, and attract every good thing you ever wish. Happy Easter, everyone. Happy Easter, my wonderful people, my fans, my friends, my family, my everything, my supporters, and my backbone. Of course, without you, there would nothing be Jenny Action TV. From the bottom of my heart, I appreciate you all, and I say it once again, Happy Easter. May God bless you to swim in the ocean of joy that only He gives in this Easter by providing all your needs according to his riches in glory in Christ Jesus. And may that same spirit that raised Jesus from death dwells in you as well as quickens your mortal body in order to actualize your potential in this particular second quarter of the year we are about to enter. Once again, I appreciate you all. I wish you a wonderful Easter celebration. Easter reminds us of the death and resurrection of Jesus. And Jesus has triumphed over all the powers of the enemy, over principalities and powers, and make an open show of them publicly. And of course, giving us the same victory. And Jesus being the head of principalities, no power will ever have dominion over us because by his stripes we are healed and we overcome the enemy by the blood of the lamb. And above all, Remember this, that Jesus loves us. And the best thing you can actually give to Jesus today is your life. And by God's grace, in today's video, I wish to share a wonderful recipe for you that will help you to be transformed in and out. Because believe me, Bible made us to understand in Revelation 22 verse 2 that the leaves are for the healing of the nations. And believe me, everything that you see under this planet Earth is for a purpose. There is need for us to be transformed. There is need for us to be healed inside out, emotionally, psychologically, spiritually, physically. And then, being that today is the very last day of this month, then we will now have a triumphant entry into April, being the beginning of the second quarter of the year, we are will pack our blessings like sand and enjoy the victory that, that we are celebrating today in remembrance of the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ. So on that note, I welcome you back to this our wonderful family in this particular channel. I discuss three important variables which are actually health, safety and spirituality. In this channel, we pray strategic prayers. We read the word of God in and out. We believe in balance. That is actually why we do spiritual work because actually the Bible says faith with your work is dead. So if this is the very first time you are being part of this family, you are highly welcome. Please kindly hit the red subscribe button and the bell notification so as to always get my next upload. For my returning subscribers, I love you so much. Thank you for always stopping by. So without wasting time, let's dive in. Now, this particular recipe I wish to share with you today work every time and any time you can actually do it so long as you follow this particular process. But if I were you, if I can get the materials that is needed for this recipe, I will actually do it tonight and then use it to enter the new month. I know that we already have our end of month cleansing and also the special communion spiritual ritual that I posted earlier about yogurt and bread. Make sure you partake of that because actually Jesus told the apostle when he was observing the last supper with them before his crucifixion, do this in remembrance of me. Even if you will not do it for anything, do it in remembrance of Christ and believe me, you will attain another level of victory in life, breakthrough and a abundance attraction so that is by the way now how are you going to do this particular spiritual work any day you decide to do it you are going to wake up by 11 p.m 11 p.m is one hour to 12 midnight and 12 midnight is the end of the old day to the beginning of the new day that is a highly symbolic number 11 of course is a number of new beginning that is a kind of double new beginning and believe me the next one we are about to enter is kind of beginning thing of a new month and a new quarter of the year we must remove all the negativities and all the blockages 
all the hindrances, obstacles, sorrows, lack, poverty that operated in the first quarter, we must leave it there and enter with a new vibration of positive energy, open door, riches, and the every good thing that we ever wish. The first thing you actually need to do this powerful spiritual work is actually a bottle of Fanta. Sometimes some people will be asking, why will we be using Fanta for spiritual work? Because of the color. Believe me, you see this color? It's made up of red and yellow color. By the time you combine red and yellow color, you come up with this orange. And orange attracts abundance, attracts love, trap protection when it comes to color. That is why when you use orange for spiritual work, you will get lots and lots of blessings. And believe me, Bible says weeping may endure for a night. According to Psalm 30 verse 5, and joy come in the morning. God is going to pass through this and cause joy to be part and parcel of your life by morning. Because believe me, everything that God created have both spiritual and physical benefit, including what man created. In the Bible, there were drinks. The first miracle of Jesus is converting water into wine. So today, we want to turn this drink or our wine, being that we are celebrating already, into abundance, into joy, into sweetness. Because actually, Jesus said the work he has done, we will do more. So we want to copy from our ultimate model, which is Jesus, by converting this into our unusual breakthrough. In the past, I've made some videos about Fanta. Then the second thing you need for this particular spiritual work is bitter leaf. Because you are going to be using Psalm 51 that God should have mercy on you all the ways you did not do it well in first quarter in order to make sure that this second quarter you're able to get everything you want and then you never make mistake. You work in dominion, work in transformation and renewal. Now, if you go to Revelation 22 verse 2, the Bible says the leaves are for the healing of the nation. Now, let's look at Psalm 51 verse 7 here because we are going to be using it for prayers too. Psalm 51 verse 7 said, Purge me with his soap and I shall be clean. Purge me with his soap and I shall be clean. Wash me and I will be whiter than snow. Now, look at it. We may not know exactly what his soap is, but we understand one thing that soap foams. And spiritually, anything that foams to a great extent attracts abundance, attracts goodness. And then when we talk about bitter leaf, I made a lot of videos about it. It removes causes. It removes obstacles. It removes everything that will not make you to be happy. And then, when all those blockages and hindrances and obstacles leave your life, you will get anything you want. And any prayer you pray is answered immediately. And that is why I said, any day you are going to do it, wake up by 11 p.m. Make sure you have get your fresh bitter leaf. And if you're opportune to have bitter leaf where you pluck it by yourself, it will be awesome. When you are going to pluck it, Please pluck it with the left hand because actually left hand is our spiritual hand. The right hand and spiritual hands also have their different spiritual benefit. And when you are plucking it, talk to it. You can get a small water and sprinkle it because all of them are being they hear they they talk, they communicate and say, by the power the, the Almighty God has packaged in you. As I pluck you for this spiritual work of transformation, ending of lack, ending of hatred ending of poverty backwardness disappointment failure failure at the age of breakthrough in my life please work for me then you now pluck as much as possible like see my own at least you have to pluck as much as possible then once you bring it into your house you can keep it where air will touch it or where like a little bit of sun we hit it then exactly 11 p.m midnight wake up Read Psalm 51, asking God for mercy in any way you did not do it well in the previous moons. And then praying that the new moons you are about to enter or you have entered, depending on the day you are doing it, that God will do, do transformation work in your life, give you the grace to live a better life and attract abundance, attract love. Because one fine thing about bitter leaves is that it removes hatred. And wherever you go, people will love and favor you. Your God will give you new destiny helpers. Then you now squeeze it very well 
well, making sure that you add the little water. Then when you squeeze it, be the way you come into this world and rub all the waters of this bitter leaf in your body. R rub all the waters. If you want it to be more powerful, you can add a little bit of salt. If you don't want with or without salt, it works perfectly. Then rub it all your body. Make sure that your body absorbs it to a great extent. Then after you finish rubbing it, you pray. Quoting Psalm 30 verse 5, you should have it often, that weeping may endure for a night, but joy cometh in the morning, that tonight, everything that has made you to weep in the previous moon, everything that has set you back in the previous moon, that is ending tonight, that by morning, that you are going to celebrate in joy. Then, you allow it to dry in your body, you don't bat it, go back and sleep. Believe me, you are going to dream. If you do it very well, make sure your palm, the sole of your feet everywhere, then the period you are praying, it will not dry. Go back to sleep with it. If your phone is such or your bed sheet is such that you feel that it will dirty it, you can change and put a wrapper or anyhow you manage it or you can even sleep on a mat if you have, but carry it till daybreak. And make sure that as at the time you have started of using the water, to squeeze in all your body, praying that let every negativity, blockages, backward and disappointment be drained away from your life. That is already 12 midnight. Believe me, when Jesus was about to be crucified, then he was calling disciples to come and pray with him. He said, can't you watch with me for an hour? It means that day, ideal time you should spend in the presence of God. Whenever you come to pray, whether midnight or not, it's at least one hour. So between 11 to 12, let it be that you have you are praying once it's 12 midnight bam you start rubbing this then after you have rubbed it pray more go and sleep then in the morning when you wake up before you talk to any human being then get your early morning urine and then pour it inside your bath water if you want you can boil water that is warm because that is best water to bet and then carry this full container of fanta Pour into it, J, 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 and get me Revelation 5 verse 12. Pray inside that water all these attributes that Jesus has brought to us. Because if you know the book of Revelation 5, it is where it's, it, the Bible is saying that there was a cry in heaven because no one is worthy to open the book. And then the Lion of tribe of Judah now prevail, which is Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We are celebrating his death and resurrection today. So look at all the things he now received on our behalf. So you now walk into your position by praying it into that water. Declare that as you burn this water, just as the day Jesus was baptized in River Jordan, that this attribute will be baptized into your life and you become a winner. Revelation 5 verse 12, it says, Saying with a loud voice, Worthy is the Lamb that was slain to receive power. You declare that you are receiving power today to overcome all the powers of the enemy, to trample upon serpent and scorpion, that none will ever hurt you again in this life. And then the next, Receive riches. You declare that the riches of Gentiles are yours and that God will baptize you with the abundance, riches, money that you will never lack in life again. And then the next one says wisdom. Wisdom is the principal thing of another get and get understanding. This is actually what God gave to Solomon and he, ex he excelled above his, above his contemporary. And of course, I'm going to do video very soon about the riches of Solomon. And then you will know what's the secret of the riches of Solomon so that you will understand that secret, tap into it and become rich. So you now declare that God, because the Bible said in the book of James, is the only one that lack of wisdom, let him ask. Use that opportunity and pray that as you bat with this water, let wisdom begin to dwell in you. That this wisdom will make you to excel wherever you go. Then the next one is, and the, and the strength. You now declare that the joy of the Lord is your strength, that from today, we will begin to have strength. From That your strength will continue to increase day by day. And that anything that will take away your joy, that will make your strength to be broken, make you to be weak, that God will take it away, be it sickness, be it backwardness, anything. Then the next one is honor. You begin to declare, Bible said, in our shame, he will give us double honor. That every shame you have suffered, that there will be double honor for you. Shame of remaining single, that, and, and then people are mocking you, that all your mates are married and you are not married, that it ends today. Then again, the next one, 
which is glory and blessing. You now declare that God will glorify you wherever you come. You will come with a new aura, new splendor. People will see you and respect you and will not talk to you anyhow. And finally, the blessings of God make it rich and add end of sorrow. The end of sorrow in your life that you will be swimming in the blessings of God. Then after you, you have put your right middle finger and pray this inside this water, that water, carry that water, enter into your bedroom and have a cleansing bed, making sure that you clean, you bat out all those bitter leaf water you can actually use your soap at the beginning of that bath but don't miss your soap inside that particular water using the same water then remain like half of the water before you remove soap and sponge then you now bath down only that Fanta and your early morning urine mixture water bath it very well allowing that water to dry in your body with your soap with your sponge with your water in your body with your rubbing cream on that day and believe me you will see how throughout the month and beyond how you'll be swimming in ocean of favor open door breakthrough success money honor blessings splendor and everything that jesus have received for us so go and try this i'm waiting for your testimony in the comment section please and please always come back and testify why some of you will get testimony today tomorrow you will not get again is because you ate the glory of god previous recipe you did but once you are such that is showing god gratitude by testifying because gratitude is the best attitude you will continue testifying so if you have not subscribed to this channel kindly subscribe hit the bell notification and be part of the family also share this video widely press thumbs up before you sign out from this video and god will bless you so with this i say happy easter once again enjoy your celebration Bye bye